1813, James Madison portrait has featured on the mobile series of the $5,000 Treasury Bureau notes. The large value notes are originally redeemable as a value of gold. It also features George Washington resigning his commission in 1861. Greenbacks, the dollar of $5, $10, $20 was from the Civil War. This remain valid. This remain valid and redeemable at full face value. Also in 1861, a $10 note issue with a portrait of President Abraham Lincoln. Also, each demand note was redeemable in gold or silver at the time. In 1862, the Treasury seals first appeared in the currency system during the Civil War in the United States, the North and the South. The icon of the key scales and stars in 1863, Congress creates the Office of the Controller of the Currency and National Currency, as well for a new version of National Big Notes. In 1863, the American money has dipped liberty and justice as a allegorical figures. And justice can be seen holding her scales. She appears on the right side of the $50 bill currency. In 1863, Congress establishes the national banking system and authorizes the U.S. Department of the Treasury to oversee the issuance of national bank notes. In 1863, the first $100 and $500 national bank note that feature John Trumbull's being the name Declaration of Independence and Surrender of Generals. Both of the pain is claimed to be in the, in the U.S. Capitol building. In 1865, the Secret Service is established from that year. This activity became less the public confidence in national currency at the time. In 1869, the portrait of George Washington was featured in the first feature in the $1 US currency in 1869. The Bureau of Engraving and Pain began engraving and printing the faces and also seals of US banknotes in 1874. Congressional Legislation organized the U.S. Department of the Treasury's Bureau of Engraving and Printing of BEP, for sure it was. Specific allegations of operation funds in 1875. In 1877, the United States Congress decided to mandate the U.S. Department of the Treasury performs engraving and printing of notes, bonds, and other securities in the United States. 1878, the U.S. Department of the Treasury issues certificates. In 1881, Senator Blaine C. Kelso Bruce is the first African American or Black American to have his name in American paper currency in 1886 there was a woman named Martha Washington in 1886 to 1896 series in 1890 US Department of the Treasury started to use treasury notes in 1896 there was a man named Emmanuel 
and then sure was a resident for counterfeiting banknotes. He is his nickname for him was Jim the Penman in 1896. The one dollar US no has alleged you one dollar US no had allegorical figures and also a uh, two dollar notes. One is history instructing the youth. One is figures of science presenting the children, steam, and electricity into adults, commerce, and manufacturers. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and find this video valuable and educational. Have a good day.